The Royal Navy patrols Egypt's coastline, while its carrier-based Venoms, Wyverns and Seahawks carry out their task of destroying Nasser's airfields and supporting the Anglo-French landings in the Canal Zone. Working in close cooperation with the RAF, they play their part in a round-the-clock bombing program which brings high praise from the Army Chiefs. The accuracy and speed of their attacks makes the soldiers' job far simpler. And in this operation, watched so closely by the nations of the world, everything depends on rapid success. For one aim of the Allied action is to safeguard the canal, and the Egyptians have sunk several ships in the channel in an attempt to make it unusable. Allied aircraft were able to frustrate this plan to some extent by sinking the block ships before they could be towed into their most effective position. All right, guys, and we're going to take that mission in Crisis 1956. We'll be flying for the French naval air arm, and we're on station. Our targets are merchant naval vessels. And our flight has just dropped heavy ordnance on one. If these merchant vessels make it to the Suez Canal area, we're done. So we're going to fly a French naval F4U-7 and line up on the enemy merchant ships. We got a hit in. These merchant ships are no victims. They're armed with 20 millimeter AAA guns and we just took a hit from one. So we're lining up and it's time to go damn buster and two out. And that looked real close. That had to have caused a lot of damage. And we're given our wingman commands to attack the ships. We want to make sure we accomplish this. Naval airstrike. So we're going to line up. Generate some speed so our bombs skip. We want them to bounce right into the side of the hull. Triple A's firing us. Bombs out. Took some more hits. And we got a confirmed enemy ship destroyed. Right on target. Care, women are reporting enemy fighters. There's a nearby airfield. We're going to head that way. We still have ordnance. Both merchant ships are out of action. All right, we're heading over to the airfield. The question is whether to jettison our bomb load or hang on to them. I'm going to try to get a little bit closer. We got uh, plenty of wingmen over the airfield. And the enemy fighters are on the runway. It's a good thing we hung on to the ordnance lining up. Six out. Oh, and we're right on target. All right. Good BDA. Why fight when you can bomb? All right, let's take her in. Successful mission. 
and we're calling the ball. Heavy seas, high winds. Nose up. And we caught the last wire. A little bumpy, but we made it. Well, guys, we're going to have to give this victory to the French Naval Air Forces. F4U-7, tremendous airplane. It can hold a load of bombs. Well, let's taxi forward. Well, guys, I hope you liked this mission. It sure was fun to fly. Endless scenarios you can create in IL-2-1946. Let's check our score. And not too bad. One vessel and two ground kills. Thanks for watching, guys.